What's up everybody, it's AJ with eTrail.com. Today we're gonna to be checking out the drop ball accessory for our shocker hitch shanks. So it's gonna be good if you maybe bought another combination, maybe you got the pencil hook or the double ball combo and you need to get a drop ball for a different trailer. Maybe you got a newer trailer that goes a little bit lower and you just can't get that with those attachments. Well, that's what these accessories are all about for the shocker hitch, so you can swap that out. Now you have a two and five sixteenths ball and that drop to get that trailer level. Let's check it out. Take a closer look at the mount and the ball here. It's gonna be made out of a grade 50 steel with a black powder coat on it, so you don't have to worry about leaving it on the back of your vehicle and expose the elements. Even if it does get some scratch, it's gonna be resistance to the rust and the corrosion. Same thing with the ball, it's gonna have a zinc plating on it though, and it's also gonna be able to hold up just fine. But as you know, when you go to use these ball, you go to put a coupler on there and it's gonna scratch it up a little bit. You could maybe put some greaser on there to try and protect it for a little bit longer, but it should hold up pretty well. Look at our drop ball here. The whole point of getting this is just to get a little bit more out of your shank in the drop position. You can see already how much more it comes down. You're gonna get two more inches than if you had the combo ball. That would stop short at like five and a half inches of drop. This one, you're gonna get a full seven and a half inches. So I can show you there from the base of the ball here to the top of the shank. That's where we're measuring. That's where we get that seven and a half drop from. So. That's gonna help you out with that trailer. Now, the only other thing to think about, which I guess doesn't matter too much because you're buying this accessory to get low for that trailer, so you're not really gonna wanna put it in a high position, but if you were to try and do that, it would just become level with the shank. I mean, maybe that helps somebody out there that has a trailer that's already level and you don't need that drop, so you can still use the same accessory. You don't have to completely swap out accessories, but just showing you that you get no drop here in the rise position. Another thing to think about is making sure you're using the right ball with the right trailer. So this is, the whole assembly is gonna have a weight capacity of 12,000 pounds, and it's gonna have a tongue weight rating of 1,200 pounds. Now the ball does say it has a 16,000 pound weight rating, but we always default to the weakest part of the system, which is gonna be the shank. So it says 12,000, we're sticking with 12,000. Today we're looking at the two and five sixteenths ball on the drop mount, but they also offer a two inch ball combination with it already installed there. Now, if you are have those two different kind of trailers and you're always using either the two inch or two and five sixteenths, you're using that combo ball maybe, and it's easy to flip that around. This is gonna be like that. You're gonna have to remove this to install this one and torque it down, which is very time consuming, kind of defeats the purpose of getting the adjustable ball mount where you can flip up accessories very quickly and easily. So I would suggest just getting another drop ball and just getting the two inch one, having that on there and just swapping out the accessory when you need to. It's gonna be far easier than loosening this and then torquing the new one down. Overall, I think it's a nice thing to have. It's a good accessory just in case you get that one trailer or even you get a new truck and it's just not level and you get a little bit more drop out of your accessory without having to buy a whole new assembly for it. You can just buy this one attachment, throw it in your shocker hitch and get it adjusted and get set up far quicker. Well, I think that does it. Thanks for hanging out. I hope this helped.